Java's first 1.21 and 1.1 release candidate has just released, meaning that should be releasing within the next couple weeks, which might be the reason as to why we've not seen bundles yet. Maybe for such an expected feature, they'd want it to release on both Java and Bedrock at the exact same time, and before that, they just wanted to get through a whole bunch of bug fixes and things like that. I wouldn't put it past Java or Mojang or the devs to do anything like that, and in the case that is something that is happening, then... As soon as 1.21.1 releases, which should be happening within maybe a week or two or something like that, then hopefully, finally, fingers crossed, we should finally be able to see bundles released inside of both Bedrock and Java. You can only hope, but until then, we have an entirely different preview with a whole bunch of name changes to a whole bunch of different items inside of Bedrock Edition to completely match the name changes inside of Java Edition, because for some reason there was just like some name differences between both Java and Bedrock for a huge array of items, and now as this one preview, those name changes are pretty much completely gone, so save for like chain boots or something like that, now they're actually called chainmail boots, just like how it is in Java Edition. Save for like a milk bucket, now it's actually called a milk bucket inside of Bedrock. Say the clay balls, it's actually called clay balls. A whole bunch of items like that has been completely renamed to match Java Edition's naming system. And while it is including things like this inside the game, it's also including other different types of things such as enchanting books because for some reason for the longest time, the enchanting books would say the one level would always just show the enchantment level at one or something like that, say with like thorns or something like that. Well, now as this one preview, it should just be showing like say the actual enchantment rather than the protection one or something like that. So if we actually try this out right now and actually see if we can uh, can put something on something. Like, let's say we put a diamond sword and unbreaking one on. Now we should, okay, that's kind of weird, it's still showing it. Well, as to the change log stating, it should only sh show unbreaking, but uh, for me right now, it seems like it's not completely implemented inside the game yet. But you know, things like this is not the end of the world, it's just something that might need looking into in the case that uh, it's doing something wrong, or in the case that maybe I'm doing something wrong, maybe that maybe that's the case. But something I know isn't the case is the fact that now inside the game, there's actually an inbuilt screenshot taking feature you could actually use inside the game because every single time I go to take a thumbnail or something like that I always have to use like say the PC it built in screenshot taking capture device well now as this one preview there's actually a built in game screenshot taking thing so say if I want to take a screenshot of this entire wall or something like that then all I have to do is go down to this one camera item we can see it right over here push it, it'll actually take a screenshot as we can see right there, and now it's actually saved to my gallery. The one thing I've noticed though is the fact that if you were to do that, then your skin, okay, it didn't happen to me this time, but I've occasionally have seen it where like your skin would go back to like the default skin setting or something like that, and I don't know if that's like a every single time thing or if it's just like a one time thing, but it's just something to, uh, to look out for in the case you are taking screenshots inside the game now. And there's also been a bunch of graphical and technical different types of changes inside the game, but apart from that, that's pretty much the bulk of this update, so yeah. Let me know what you think of down below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later.